everyone. We are going, or I'm going to be showing you how to log into Google Classroom if you are using a computer at home. Okay, if you are using a Chromebook that's been checked out from the school, um, you should be able to log in because everything is saved already on the Chromebook. But if you are using a, a device at home, this video is going to help you log in, okay? So I'm going to leave this up for one second, but when you go to Google, it looks something like this, okay? So it looks like this when you go to Google. I highly recommend that you use Google Chrome, okay? And I'll show you what that icon looks like. It looks just like this right here. So use Google Chrome. Do not use Internet Explorer or any of the others. Um, reason being, Google Chrome is compatible with Google Classroom, and so it'll be much easier for you to access classwork and things like that with Google Chrome, okay? So when you go to Google, it looks like this, and over here in the top right-hand corner, there's a button that says Sign In. So you're gonna click on that button, and I already have one open over here. So once you click on that button, Maybe I have one open. Yep, right here. Okay. Once you click on that button, you're going to put into you in your Granite SD account. Okay. Now, you have to use your Granite SD or it's not going to work. It won't connect you to our classroom. Um, if you don't know your Granite SD account, then you can reach out to your teachers and they can help you get that information. Okay. So, I'm using a um, Granite SD account for one of my students um, for my class just so I can show you how to get in here, okay? So this is my student's Granite SD account. Again, if you don't have it, reach out to your teacher. We can send it to you, okay? Then you're going to click Next, and it's going to send you to a page that looks like this, okay? So it's got our Granite School District logo here. And you're going to type in your Granite SD account one more time. Okay, so something like that. And the password is going to be the password that you use to log into your Chromebook at school. Okay, so the password that you use to log into your Chromebook at school. So I'm going to type that, and it's going to redirect one more time. So it may ask you to verify that it's you. All you have to look at when you get here is the email address. If that's your email address, your Granite SD email address, you're going to click Continue, and it's going to sign you in. So what it does is it takes you right back to Google. Okay, So it takes you right back here. It kind of kicks you out. Over here in the top right hand corner should be a little circle with the first letter of your first or last name. Okay, so that tells you that you're signed in. Okay, then you're going to hit these this little Google Apps icon right here. This is just the, the nine boxes stacked on top of each other. We've used this in class uh, many times to access Google Docs. Okay, so you're going to click on that and this little menu is going to pop up. When this menu pops up, you're going to see an icon, which is right here, that says Classroom, okay? So there is a little rectangular chalkboard thing that says Classroom. So you're going to click on that. It's going to take you there. It's a little bit slow. Okay, when you're here, it's going to show you um, our classroom, okay? So it says 5th grade, Plymouth Elementary, Okay, it's showing you as an unknown user because you have not joined the class yet. So to join the class, you're just going to hit this blue join button. And it will take a second. Okay, then it should take you right into the classroom where you can look at the classwork that needs to be done. Okay, and I created another video that your teacher should have sent out to you showing you how to, to navigate through this and how to work on the classwork tab, okay?